Lazarus and Zembe looks at his field with disbelief. Last year, a drought withered the maize. Now, excessive rain has drowned most of his harvest. This unpredictable weather makes survival tougher with each passing year. We are still finding it difficult to adjust to climate change. In this farming season, we planted our maize seed, and unfortunately, part of it died off because there was so much rain. And things are continuing to get worse. Nothing will come out of this crop here. Yeah. This is just nothing. Agronomists at a renowned crop research institute in Harare inspect a trial field. The fall armyworm, an invasive species, has done a lot of damage here and throughout the country. It's estimated that about a tenth of the maize crop is affected. Insecticides have been used to contain the pest, but the scientists say only a balanced ecosystem with natural pest predators can ensure success in the future. We work with other partners on biological control of the pest and also through agronomic measures like conservation agriculture, intercropping, integration of trees that increase the diversity in the landscape and also help to control pests in a biological way. Meanwhile, climate change continues to threaten Zimbabwe's farmers. But hope is rising high in this village in Zvimba district. The region's farmers have all suffered harvest losses. Now, representatives from the Ministry of Agriculture and a private seed production company say they have a solution, a new variety of maize. Its brand name is Zap 61. The hybrid of traditional maize varieties is better adapted for both drought and excessive rain. It's said to yield 20 to 30 percent more than conventional maize. Lazarus and Zembe and other farmers are interested but cautious. The new maize requires new farming techniques and it's more expensive. And the farmers would also have to spend money to fertilize the soil. Overall, I think this is a good maize seed. However, I might have to buy four sacks of fertilizer for my one hectare of maize. Other farmers have already changed to the new maize variety. Philbert Moroe thinks farmers should try something new in order to achieve better results. What really astonished me is that on the two hectares worth that I planted, AgriSeed Zap 61 outperforms the other alternative varieties with the same maturity dates. The results are quite impressive. Zap 61 is up to 25 percent more expensive than traditional maize varieties. The scientists back in Harare have developed their own new maize varieties. They say that since the soil in many parts of Zimbabwe is not very fertile, maize farmers have to move away from monoculture. If you rotate it with other crops, legumes, like cow peas, pigeon peas, soybeans, groundnuts, you can reduce pests and diseases and overall improve the soil fertility. For Lazarus Nzembe and his wife Patricia, it's decision time. Whether to just hope that next season climate change will not hit them as hard again, or to embrace new technologies that come at a price.